What are your thoughts on generative AI? Is generative AI the answer to a lot of these challenges? A lot, you know, it, it seems like almost everybody's putting AI in front of everything today. Um, I really don't think it's a one size fits all. Um, I think AI is really good at summarizing data and processing documents and a lot of text. I think it's really fun for content creation. And, you know, there's only so much humans are gonna scale. So being able to augment that with AI and, and, the, and the massive uh, processing ability that it brings is, is really, you know, how you wanna be thinking about the two. And here at the conference, we are seeing a lot of allocators, investors, funds talk about their investment strategies and how they are navigating this space, especially with the new tech that's coming in. How do you see the investment landscape change in terms of traditional, alternative, automated? How are things changing? Yeah, so I think there's a lot of change happening right now in the uh, quantitative space, right? So I think you know, a lot of strategies are going beyond what they would consider uh, traditional uh, data and really looking at alternative assets. That could be climate, that could be things related to location. And you know, the ability to connect that to your investment portfolio, the, the ability to connect that to your investment thesis is becoming more and more hard. Because when you're dealing with these alternative uh, investments, you know, they don't come with standard identifiers. As we think about traditional finance, you think about your QCIPs, ITINs, ICINs, CEDLs, FIGGIES, you know, PERM IDs and RICs. Um, this is just text. So how do I you know, get a better understanding of how these alternative assets fit within my broader portfolio? Um, and I think that you know, is really you know, coming to change, right? Because again, end of day, whether you're looking at a CRM or you're thinking about your ERP, it's all about you know, how do I connect data to have a unified view? So I have the real world understanding of, of what's happening. Um, and I think we're gonna continue to see a lot of change in that space. And you know, the ability to really understand how to bring it all together uh, is gonna become more and more uh, critical.